Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. Brazil's President Luis Lula da Silva recently visited China to meet with President Xi Jinping. Bilateral. The aim of the visit was to strengthen ties between two of the world's largest developing nations. Brazilian officials said about 20 bilateral agreements were signed with China. Bilateral describes something that only two individuals, groups, or countries share. The Latin-based prefix bi means two. And lateral means of or related to the two different sides. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. Scientists who study the Great Barrier Reef in Australia say they have good news and bad news. Biodiversity. The Great Barrier Reef is the largest living structure on Earth. It is filled with coral, fish, and many other species creating a colorful biodiversity. For years, rising sea temperatures have caused great damage to the reef. But even so, scientists say new corals have begun to grow. Biodiversity is many different types of plants and animals living together in a certain place. Each different form of life is important to support biodiversity. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. When you hear or read stories about green technology, you might hear this word, biofuel. Listen for the word biofuel in this story about turning trash or waste into energy. What we're doing is taking a, that was originally headed for a landfill, half of this material is going to be processed for the conversion of biofuel such as ethanol. Biofuel is fuel made from plant material or animal waste. Ethanol is a biofuel made from corn and other plants. In the United States, ethanol is mixed with gasoline and used to run cars. Now, when you hear the word biofuel, your American English will be good enough to know what this news word means. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. Today's words are about becoming a citizen. Birthright citizenship. Some Republican presidential hopefuls, including businessman Donald Trump and Texas Senator Ted Cruz, say they want to do away with the so-called birthright citizenship. To do that, though, would take a constitutional amendment. Birthright citizenship is the legal right to citizenship for children born in a country's territory. Any person born in the United States is given birthright citizenship. Now, when you hear the words birthright citizenship, you will know what these news words mean. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. Jeff Bezos owns the internet company Amazon and the Washington Post newspaper. He is the richest person in the world. Blackmail. In February, Bezos accused the owner of the National Enquirer tabloid newspaper of blackmail. Bezos wrote the tabloid threatened to publish private photographs of him and his girlfriend if he did not stop his investigation into its practices. Blackmail is the crime of demanding money or cooperation from someone in return for not releasing damaging information about them. Blackmail is similar to extortion, the crime of getting money 
by using threat. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. This news word is about difficulty linked to war. Blackout. It's Friday afternoon and the bikers are out, letting off steam, showing off stunts, impressing their friends. Welcome to Baghdad and the world of the Iraqi bikers. It's a way to forget the blackouts, the bombs, the violence. A blackout is when lights are turned off to guard against enemy attacks in a war. A blackout can also be the result of an electrical power failure. And for people, blackouts are a sudden loss of sight, memory, or consciousness. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. China has had its largest protests in years. Blank. Last fall, Chinese citizens protested severe COVID restrictions using blank pieces of paper. Human rights activist Yang Zhan Li said it is a way to communicate what a protester wants to say but cannot because of political pressure. COVID cases are now rising in China as restrictions and protests have eased. Blank describes something that is empty of information and imagery. But it can also be a verb. If you forget something, you can say you blanked. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. A show at the Paris Zoological Park is the first of its kind. Blob. A single cell organism that has no mouth, no stomach, and no eyes, but can identify food and use it, is being shown at the Paris Zoo. The blob is a living being and a mystery of nature, says the director of the Paris Museum of Natural History. A blob is a small amount of something that is thick and wet, like a blob of paint. It is something that does not have a regular shape. In this example, it is a slime mold that lives in dead plant material. Now you know what blob means. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. The digital money, Bitcoin, is traded online with a new accounting system. Blockchain. The concern with digital money, like Bitcoin, is that, like everything else on the internet, people fear it can be hacked and stolen. But supporters say that is not possible with blockchain technology. A blockchain is a record of all the user's transactions. Each completed transaction is called a block. It is linked to the previous blocks and saved. Together, the blocks form a blockchain that all users can see and that cannot be changed. Welcome to the Voice of America's News Words. In the United States, COVID-19 cases are on the rise. Breakthrough. Experts say the Delta variant is one reason. People who are not vaccinated against COVID-19 make up the most cases and deaths. Among fully vaccinated people, evidence shows a small minority getting breakthrough infections. In medicine, a breakthrough infection happens when a virus breaks through the barrier a vaccine provides. 
The word breakthrough also means an important discovery that happens after a long time of trying to understand something.